just a heads up. Yeah, sucks yeah. to suck. You gotta sit in front of me. Uh, making your mark a brief history of ancient vandals. So, no, I'm not taking questions. <laughs> <laughs> the light, though? Yeah. Well, because of the video. Oh. But the overhead light, though? Because the video. What video? I don't know. I don't know. We're on the clock. Stage lights. Hey, Google. Yeah, restarting the time. Yeah. Put lights at 50%. All I know is yep. last time they were at 30% sure, we're and you didn't see Jack on this because we're filming with an iPhone. That's fine. Yeah. At 50% we're good. Well, you, should restart, you, should restart, you should restart the time, we got set. Cool. Play it with Obama. Okay, Katie, are you ready? Fucking <laughs> anyways. <laughs> and we go. Making your mark, a brief history of ancient vandals. So in today's fucked up world, you often hear older, dumber people wishing for a happier time. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> a happier time, a simpler time. Is she looking down at shorts? <laughs> 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 traditional values <laughs> and I'm here to tell you that that's all bullshit anyway because humans are as humans always have been uh, the Vikings got around and when I say they got around they fucking got around I mean they're down into like Byzantine they got around they got some pretty nice folks um, and when they got down into Byzantine Emperor Basil of the Byzantine Emperor really liked that there was these giant six-foot blonde dudes and he was like I'm gonna get you guys and you're gonna be my guard. And the Vikings, knowing a good deal when they see one, got paid to fuck shit up, which is what they do the best. Uh, so they decided to build the Varangian guard, and they were the most colorful, sassiest bitches on the battlefield. <laughs> um, like their clown pants. The <laughs> Carved into the parapets that have been discovered, or they, they were believed to be holy runes. Um, and it wasn't until actually recent history that someone felt the need to go in and translate them, and they say, Half Dan wrote this. <laughs> 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 in Scotland, in this tiny little island in the middle of Scotland, we had these mighty, ferocious, earlier Vikings. Not these guys. <laughs> Not these guys. There we go. Um, and they were besought by a storm and were forced to take refuge in an even older tomb for several days. And their boredom is etched on the walls now with poetry and their names. And 14 feet off the ground, it says, these are very high. <laughs> built under the shadow of Vesuvius, Vesuvius blew up, and everybody had a really, really, Aww. really bad day. <laughs> Pompeii is also known for its graffiti, with things such as, oh I forgot to memorize this bit. Doctor the Emperor Titus had a good crap here. <laughs> the boss ain't worth a rat's ass. And Solotus makes the girl moan. <laughs> they had some of their favorite uh, gladiators doing battle on the walls, and of course, yeah. lots and lots and lots of dicks. Thank you. Um, and as did the Greeks so, or Greeks, so did the Romans, so the Romans took it to another level. To fascinate is to attract and hold attentively by a unique power. Fascinus is the embodiment of the divine phallus. This is the root of fascinate, which basically means holy dicks. <laughs> they put that shit on everything. They put it on oil lamps. They put it on statues and toys. They put it on rings, specifically protection rings for children. <laughs> but on their masonry and in places where they felt that it was it was a, a way to protect themselves in case of danger. Um, and whatever the fuck this thing is. <laughs> <laughs> so really, if Russell Crowe wanted to 
wanted Gladiator to be at all historically accurate, it would have looked more like this. <laughs> Are you not entertained? <laughs> Some old person is getting on to be immature or bullshit like that. Uh, you can just tell them that you are, oh, and they're talking about, you know, traditional values and, and how it used to be. You can just tell them you are doing a time honored tradition and tell them to go eat a dick. <laughs> Thank you.